zero day vulnerability. Ever wondered about getting your first zero day? Today we are diving into the exciting world of zero day vulnerabilities. In this video, we'll cover everything you need to know to get started with zero day exploits in both binary softwares and web applications. So, this is Emersec, Google Air Cafe and let's dive in. Before we begin, it's crucial to set up a safe and controlled testing environment. You can use, for example, VMware to create your virtual lab where you can safely test for your vulnerabilities. Zero day exploits in binary software. Binary software vulnerabilities can be difficult to detect, but they are incredibly impactful. To find zero day vulnerabilities, we use a specialized tools called fuzzers. And today we are going to use AFL, one of the most powerful fuzzing tools available. Fuzzers work by bombarding an application with a random inputs to find a crashes and unexpected behaviors. Now I will show you how to install AFL and start using it. Okay guys, to install AFL, what you have to do simply is just type sudo apt update and give it a couple of seconds and after that what you have to do is just sudo apt install AFL and if it did not work with you like that, just give it a plus plus like what it's asked you here, AFL plus plus and hit enter and like that, that tool is installed with you. If you want to know more about the tool options and usage, you can check out the article link down in the description to know more about it. And that's it for binary software vulnerabilities. Now let's move on to web application zero day. Web applications are frequent target for attackers. You need to explore common vulnerabilities like SQL injection, XSS cores, IDOR, CSRF, and more using tools like Burbsuit and WaspZap. Burbsuit is one of the most popular and important tools for finding zero days. To get started, you can download it and install it from Bortiswigger official website. Once installed, you can start to use its powerful scanning features to find vulnerabilities. Similarly, WaspZap, it's another great tool for web application security testing. It's a free and open source making it accessible for anyone to use it. To use WaspZap, you can download it from a Wasp website and follow their installation guide. Once installed, you can use its automated scanners and manual testing to start finding vulnerabilities. Once we have identified potential vulnerabilities, it's time to analyze and exploit them. Interpret the results from fuzzers and web scanners to create a proof of concept exploit. For example, if you found an XSS vulnerability, you have to craft a pilot to demonstrate how the attacker can exploit it. And that's it for zero day vulnerabilities. But I want you to remember that ethical hacking about making the digital world safer. Always disclose vulnerabilities responsibly and use your skills for good. And congratulations, you have taken your first step in mastering zero day exploits. Remember, with a great power comes great responsibility. If you enjoyed this video, do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more cybersecurity content. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments below or you can reach me directly using Twitter. Until next time, stay curious and stay secure. Have the Satra Kulumra. Hey, 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 hey.